Welcome back to another Coolizer Tech video. As you can see here, this is a product review of the M Lens V2. It's a fish eye for your phone and cameras made by Impow. As usual, we get to unbox this together so we get the first impression and then we get the setup. So I'm going to take it out, or firstly, pull it out, not take it off. But look at this thing. This is actually pretty nice feeling. There's the back cover. Nice. And I believe there's two and one where this is the macro. So we can take the macro off. And then there's the regular wide angle. And then, of course, the front. And that might be my thumbnail. And here we have the phone attachment. So this will clip on your phone. And we have a little carrying bag, a little pouch to carry it in if you want to go mobile. So this is the clip that will go on your phone. And I will unscrew the back. Screw this on, and there we have it. Rubber piece right there, so it's lightly on your phone. It is a pretty strong clip. It is plastic. Okay, so I have my OnePlus, the V10, and the Nexus 6P that I'll be testing this on. So let's do the OnePlus first. Take a look here. We can see half of the Nexus. So now let's put this on here. <laughs> oh, it looks funny. But hey, let's take the cap off because I still have it on. And look at that. This gives it a big wide angle, a macro where you get right up to it, you can see really good on it. But let's take off. Now let's try the V10, reaches it just fine. I'm almost touching the lens here. And it has a really good macro, like I can see the, my fingerprints. So obviously we see a big O there, we'll be changing that here in a little bit. Let's do the Nexus last. We can see the whole lens going down, but it's wide angled and it's macro where if we get close up into it, it's gonna get really good close up shots. And we could crop them. And you're supposed to be able to use this on cameras as well. And my finger right here, that's how much we can see. We can't see the rest of the phones. We can't see the rest of the box in the background. If we put this onto it, that's how much more we can see. But this is a macro lens, remember, you're supposed to be zooming up into something really close. But I don't have the exact adapter for this to work. I'm going to go outside and I will use my V10 this time. I'm always favoring the Nexus, but I'll use the V10 with and without the macro lens. I didn't realize it's gonna be such a big circle that you can see because it's such a long lens, so we'll see how it works. Don't worry about the tunnel vision because you can actually unscrew this. Look at that closeness, you can see all the detail. Screwing it, and now it's going to be even more blurrier, but check it out. I can even get closer. Super close, you can see. I'm like into that twig. See any bugs? Alright, now let's take a look at these beetles. Oh, look at this little thing. That thing is tiny and I can see it. Look at my finger. Whoa! Ah. Look how tiny they are. That's my pointer finger. That's how tiny this thing is. And that's how close you can get. Look at that worm. Hey. Wake up! Hey, wake up! He dead? Look at those little tiny worms. They're so tiny. Look at my finger. Take the lens off and show you what it looks without the lens. Alright, you can see some beetles there. And now let's take the lens off. I'm tapping on the first beetle. It's not wanting to focus on the first beetle and I'm a little bit further away. But with the lens, oh, it's running. I see a centipede. There it comes out. Hello, beetle juice. I'm really close and I can't get that tapping on the screen. I won't focus that closely. So we do get 
that closer macro. Here's some grass. Look at that detail. You won't get that on a normal phone. Okay, last one here. I'll have to be around this far in order to get that focus. That I can't get any closer than that. So this is how far it was with the same position. And I'll get closer. And that is closer with the macro. It's like touching the lens right there. That's why it's moving. So there you guys have it. This is the macro lens from MPOW, M-Lens V2. If you're okay to bypass the tunnel vision, then this might be for you. It looks cool on your phone. It does feel like good quality to it. It doesn't feel all cheapy metal. It's actually metal, not plastic. It's not that heavy where it's going to be you know, annoying on your phone, but it's pretty cool. So if you would like to get one for yourself, you already know what to do. In the description down below, and as always, I will see you guys next time. Later.